723. The Golf Course Superintendents Association of America is introducing STEM and an innovative environmental education program for students through the sport of golf. This morning for our hometown hotspot, we're at the Westminster National Golf Course. Joining us now is Superintendent and General Manager Ryan Kraushofer. Good morning to you. Good morning. All right, so this sounds like a, an incredible opportunity for students. What is First Green? Yeah, so First Green is a uh, STEM outreach program using uh, golf courses environmental learning labs. Not only are we introducing STEM to uh, kids and fifth graders and its hands-on learning experiences, we're also introducing educators to all the career paths and job opportunities that exist in the golf industry. Uh, so if we can, our thoughts, if we can get kids interested in STEM and golf early, then maybe we can attract employees as they get a little older. Oh, this works two ways. That's very, uh, very smart. All right, so what actually will the kids be doing? I see a lot of things laid out there on the table. Absolutely. We got uh, six stations set up today where uh, they're doing some math stations where they're doing uh, area calculations. Uh, we're learning about water conservation. They get to do some putting. They get to do some fun stations. And, you know, putting's not all fun. Putting takes into account velocity. And it also takes into account uh, contours of greens and slopes. So they're learning about that while they're having fun. Uh, we're also learning about soils and how sand, silt, and clay, the different particle size, how particles drain differently through the soil profile. So a lot of fun information that the kids are learning today. And they get to see how golf courses use STEM every day for, uh, for our jobs, you know. And so is this a one-day program, or do they come back multiple times? How does that part work? You know, so this is uh, one day. We host a couple field trips throughout the uh, year. Uh, okay. We have a great relationship with Carroll County Public Schools here. And uh, this is our first one uh, since COVID. You know, we had to take a little break because of COVID sure. and field trips for schools. Uh, but we're ramping back up, and it's a great opportunity. If any uh, teachers are listening, they can reach out to their local golf course superintendent and try to get a uh, first green uh, field trip hosted at their local facility. And we were just looking past you while you were talking a little bit, and the, the area is beautiful. I mean, you, you couldn't ask for a, a better backdrop to be out on a field trip. Absolutely. It's great weather today, luckily, and uh, we're slowly starting to green up. It's been cold up here. You know, we had a little frost yesterday morning, but uh, things are starting to green up, and we're starting to kick into our busy season. Uh, but the kids are going to have a fantastic day out here today, learning these, uh, going through six rotations and uh, learn about uh, golf course architecture and design and uh, what goes into maintaining the golf course. And then, obviously, beyond the field trips, you're open to the public to just come out and enjoy a, a good day of golf. Absolutely. We've got a packed tee sheet today, so we got a lot of kids running around and some golfers uh, to go past them. So. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, Ryan, we're going to talk to you guys throughout the morning uh, and see more of what's going on there. Thank you so much. Thank you. Well, if you want more information, it's all